In this demonstration, you'll learn how to configure Elastic Licensing on the Windows platform using the ANSYS Client Settings utility. This demonstration covers changing the Elastic Licensing pin, disabling Elastic Licensing, and gathering diagnostics data. To open the ANSYS Client Settings utility, click Start, ANSYS 22.1, and then ANSYS Client Licensing Settings 2022 R1. If your license administrator changes the PIN of the cloud license server, client-side users should update the PIN by performing the following steps. From the ANSYS Licensing Client Settings Utility, click Elastic Licensing. Select the Enable Elastic Licensing option. Click Import ID and PIN and browse to the directory containing the JSON file supplied by your Elastic Licensing Administrator. Select the file and click Open. Click Save to accept the change to your PIN. Your ANSYS LMD INI file is updated and the ID and PIN are displayed in the ANSYS Licensing Client Settings Utility. To disable Elastic Licensing, simply uncheck the Enable Licensing option and click Save. When requesting support, it may be necessary to supply Elastic Licensing related data about your system. To do this, click the Gather Diagnostics option and then click Generate. The diagnostic data is displayed in the console area. Additionally, a compressed file containing this data is saved to the product installation drive under the Users, Username, App Data, Local, Temp directory. Be aware that the App Data directory is typically hidden on the Windows platform. The compressed file containing this data is named ANSYS Diagnostics Year Month Day Time.zip. This concludes this demonstration on configuring Elastic Licensing on Windows using the ANSYS Client Settings Utility.